CF3599 here again, and this is my first LEGO tutorial, and yes, that is what you think it is, and as you think by title, it is a Horror Super Cyrix LEGO mock that I created. Let me just take it off the pole. So here it is. Yes, I'm on the top of a box, because I do not have a tripod yet. <laughs> LOL. So yeah, it rotates like this. Pretty nice and smooth. Even though it doesn't really rotate like it rotates like this. And please do not criticize me. These white horns, I do not have yellow ones. So those are just improvisation for my um YouTube video. Oh fail. Alright, hang on a second. Let me just take it out of the stand. Yes. It's a stand like what you see in like Oh, if you're on the same board like the, at Navajo Elementary School, and when they did that topic, almost there, this might be way, 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 okay, there we go. So, um, here is the stand that I made. It, all it is is just two 1x6 on the side, on these sides, one 1x2, and then a 1x1 one one right here. But there's a spot for the rotator. Now for the actual fire. All I did was, um, first, let me show you how to make the actual rotation base. First I took one of these angle brackets and a, um, round piece. And I put them on top of each other like this. And I took a yellow, um, eyelet. Erling, I mean, Erling. And then a one by one, and put it in the hole of the earling for the rotator motor. And put it in that open slot, like that. Then you have your basic rotator platform. Okay. Now, here's the actual siren. I got one of those rotating plates, and two by two, right on top. For the actual siren part, ooh, fail. I took two of these, uh, two two by two plates that are round, and then I attach a horn on the end like that. Kind of, kind of reminds me of either like an ATI or game old iPhone, even though it's not. And then I made two of them, and that's what to save time. And then basically for the center part, all I did was please do not um. Please don't be mad if you cannot find these. I had trouble too. These are true rarities to find. One of these kind of like round pieces. Then all I did was, was um took a four along. And then I attached two. I attached two one by two hole things in them. Put in the middle. Sorry about that, my aunt's here. Then I just put this piece on top. That on top there. And all I do is just flip these on. Attach it onto this part. And voila! Make sure that this part and this part line up. Like that. Then you just push it down. And there you go. That's your whore. And then basically for the, um, pole, I just took two of these pieces and attached them on top of each other. And then so it would stand up, I just put a, um, 6x10 on the bottom. Like that. So there you have it. And also, in effort to Save another video. I decided just to jumble in my Model 5. All you need are just one of these, um, one by, I mean, two by two round pieces and a, um, stud. Then you just put one of them in there, like that. And then you take either a two by two brick or three two by two plate rounds and a one by one stud. And place it right there so you have the bottom brick. Then you put them on top of each other. It looks pretty cool in gray and yellow. 
So there you have it. That's how to make a Federal Enterprises Model po Model 5 and a Whore Super Cyrex that rotates. Alrighty. You have 3599 out. I'll keep you posted.